Om Shanti. Taking everyone's loveful remembrances. When I was uh, pulled and invoked by Baba, I was in subtle regions. And it's like very beautiful feeling of when the song was going to Bab Dada. So Bab Dada's home is our home, right? So subtle regions also is like going home. So it was just a beautiful feeling of like going to Bab Dada is going home. And of course, this morning morning emerged that remember home also with Baba. So then I took Drishti from Baba. Baba gave everyone also loveful Drishti. And after that, I said, Baba brought Bhog from Avekti Parivar, Avekti Bhavan, and from everyone else. Baba gave loveful Drishti and also one who bake, makes bhog or offer bhog, their bhavana, their love. So Baba many times too mentioned their names and Baba said, children have a lot of love and bhavana. And whatever one does with bhavana brings multifold reward. Because one is to just do something, another is to do with that love, faith, pure feelings. That is what bhavna is. And when there is bhavna, uh, then Baba fulfills. It's like giving them power, giving them love. And uh, so Baba appreciates every action we do. But when it is done with bhavna, then definitely it brings many, many fold reward. And after that, Baba said, children, this is the time that all, all of you have to constantly, accurately follow Srimad. Because when it's uh, last time or it's a lot of karmic accounts will pull you and maybe sometimes get you involved in things where you shouldn't. So that is why if you follow Srimad and check before getting involved in anything. So Baba said that Srimad will not only guide you, but also with that, it is very, very important to play your part, but remain very, very detached. Because at this time, love is important, but also be detached. And that is what words Baba use, be lovely and be detached. Because Baba says then, following Srimad and remaining detached will always keep you free from obstacles. So obstacles first come internally, and then they appear externally. So it's not that we try to remove obstacles from outside, but inside, more important. So I was looking at Baba, what kind of obstacles from inside? Baba said they are very subtle. They could be of greed, they could be of ego, they could be of attachment, any. So little traces of those vices they create obstacles. And when there are obstacles, uh, then you have to be victorious. But some children also get tired. And they start questioning why there are so many obstacles. Why there are so many obstacles on my journey. And Baba smiles because Baba knows that children will have to cross all those obstacles. But do it from inside first. See what is the obstacle. What are the weaknesses. And once you do from inside, Baba says everything outside 
will also become free from obstacles. But always remember, Baba is watching you. So whenever there is uh, help needed, whenever power needed, because he's watching, he won't let you fail. He won't let you be defeated. Mm -hmm. Baba will definitely help. But you have to have your power, determination, willpower, determination will help. And wherever help is needed, uh, Baba is watching you. So always very nicely, but always remember, uh, Baba is watching me. That means there is someone who will uh, take care of me. And Baba was very loving, very sweet, and gave lots of love remembrances to each one of you. Om Shanti.